I recently revisited uh, two projects that I absolutely loved when they came out. And one of them would be uh, Nostalgia Ultra uh, by One Frank Ocean. <sighs> Novocaine would always pop up on my Spotify whenever I was had it on shuffle. And, you know, I'd like it and I'd play it back a few times. And, you know, no, Novocaine's a great song. It's always has been a great song. But then I was like, man, I really want to listen to the whole album. Now, mind you, whenever I got in that mood before, I would go to the old trusty iPod, which I no longer have. Well, I have it. I just no longer use it because I can finally stream from my phone because I moved into the 21st century about, what, three years ago, something like that. And I, I would pull up uh, Ultra, uh, Nostalgia Ultra and I would listen to the album and I would just listen to the album and I just listen to the album. And that's exactly what I did. I, I Before I left for work, I downloaded it, threw it on the phone um, and I, I listened to it on loop for the first couple hours of the day. And man, that album still holds up. It, it's it's so incredible. And it's a mixtape, even crazier. Let, let's not forget, it is a mixtape. It is not, um, oh, that's not what I wanted. It is not a true album. Um, Def Jam was going um, to release it at one point, but then Frank kind of pushed back on that. He's like, no, I don't want my first album to be um, be this. and all that so they did not end up releasing it but it came out over all-star weekend in 2011 because i remember hearing about it on the hip-hop vlogs and let me just read you the track list um in case you forgot so it starts with street fighter which is like 23 seconds low intro Sh strawberry swing <sighs> beautiful cover nova kane the song never that put him on the map we all try god i um, curse word number two, bitches talking, Middle Gear Solid. Love that song. Songs for women. And every time a nigga asks me, three curse words. If I make songs to get it, women, I say yeah. Ugh. And then it turns out he's he's by. Shout out, shout out to um the Frank for coming out of the closet. Love crimes, another amazing one. There will be tears. Swim good. Swim good at a video. I remember. Dust, another great song. American Wedding, which sampled Hotel California, and Frank was performing it um, just around places around the country. And the Eagles, where I like the Eagles, got pissed and did a cease and desist. <laughs> they were like, nah, fam. <laughs> nah, hold on. Oh, look, there's a picture of Don Henley. Uh, controversy arose over the track American Wedding, which samples the Eagles song Hotel California. Don Henley, the Eagles, had threatened legal action over Ocean's track, claiming that Ocean's version of the song was illegal. The track was widely removed from the internet following the controversy, being removed from music sharing sites such as YouTube. <laughs> a spokesperson for the band announced a lawsuit would be filed against Ocean if he would perform the song live. Oh my god. <sighs> Ocean responded on his Tumblr account. They threatened to sue for performing again. I think that's effing awesome. <laughs> <laughs> uh henley spoke out against the controversy called ocean a talentless little prick <laughs> uh stereo gum claimed henley was yelling at clouds again and um yeah i mean and then nature feels it ends the whole thing and the whole running time 42 minutes absolutely gorgeous now i know marcus prefers channel orange we talked about this on an episode where we talked about the best songs of the 2010s the best projects best albums of the 2010s best projects best albums and i know he prefers channel orange but i have always had a soft spot in my heart for um nostalgia ultra and i'll never forget it was fourth of july and i was home alone i had picked up a big old bottle of Pinot Grigio and I proceeded to drink that whole bottle of Pinot Grigio and I was recording songs drunk and then I decided I want to listen to the Nostalgia Ultra really loud and I did and then I may have laid down for about an hour for I had to be at work I got up well no like maybe two hours for I had to be at work so I slept for about an hour went to work and I was still very much drunk at work that day bad move on my part but I'll never forget 
singing Nature Feels as loud as possible. Along with Frank Ocean. Because I love Nostalgia Ultra. So that's the first thing I wanted to talk about. First uh, project.